when you set a goal, the greatest thing that you can achieve or the greatest thing you got going on is not the accomplishments, not all the mass wealth that you achieve or gain or the PR or the fame or all the other stuff, all the byproducts of achieving it. It's the process. It's the not doubting when you're achieving. You set a goal and you go achieve it. You do the things you need to do to get it done, to achieve it. It's, it's, it's complete satisfaction in you. Once you have complete satisfaction, and this is on only the level of setting a goal and going through that process of achieving it. It's not that you achieved it, it's that process that you've learned something. You learned something about yourself. You struggle, you overcame. It's the strength, it reminds us every day, the strength that we have. It's the, not sinning, it's, sin is uh, kind of like doubting. When you sin, you're, you're doubting, you're, you're, sh you're casting a doubt on the overall belief that you can do it. I know that's not the, the only definition of sin. A lot of people will say, well, Scott, that's not right. But I'm telling you, when you're sinning, you're doubting yourself. You're doubting that blind faith you need to achieve what God talks about. He says, go to the Father. Jesus says, go to the Father. He says so many times, in the book of Matthew, I think there's about 12 passages, says, if you believe it, if you have faith, if you have faith as little as a mustard seed, you can move a mountain. In the Bible, a mountain is always referred to as a kingdom. Imagine that, you can change things, you can change politics. You can change your the political going on in your country by simply having faith, figuring out how to get it done, networking with others that are in power. God puts God has put people in power for a reason. They have the authority for a reason. They have the time to achieve it for a reason. And we must believe, have faith, going to Jesus, going to God, and having faith in the system. But really, I think the point of this talk is you set a goal, you're going through that process. It's not the, the, the wealth, it's not the fame, it's not the people that you meet. It's the satisfaction of going through that struggle. It's complete satisfaction when you go through that process, when you're faithful to yourself, when you believe in yourself, and you know God is on your side. Jesus had stood by you through that trial and tribulation of your struggle to achieve your goal. No matter how big it is, no matter how small it is, God is there. Thanks.